Hi, I'm David from IT Solutions Network. We are going to hack the Wi-Fi network today. Disclaimer, hacking without proper permission is illegal. You might end up being in jail. Do not hack a network on which you don't have the authorization to do so. And please, don't use the knowledge I give you for malicious activities. To hack a Wi-Fi network, I'm going to use a microcomputer Raspberry Pi 4 running Kali Linux and a Wi-Fi adapter from Alpha with Atheros chipset AR9271, which is most compatible Wi-Fi adapter for Kali Linux. We use an external adapter because it needs to have the support of monitoring and packet injection, and the Raspberry Pi integrated Wi-Fi adapter doesn't support this. If you are interested in installing Kali Linux on your Windows computer, I recorded a video on how to install Kali Linux in VMware on Windows 10. I also have a video on how to install Kalinux on a Raspberry Pi. It shows all the steps to download and install Kalinux on a Raspberry Pi microcomputer. Now, in this hacking session, I'm going to target my wireless network where I use WPA2 encryption with a pre-shared key authorization method. It is also known as WPA PSK. To hack my wireless network, I'll need to capture the four-way handshake and then run the hash through the word lists. Okay, let's start. We need to make sure the Kalinux recognizes our external Wi-Fi adapter. Let's see what network adapters we have on Raspberry Pi and then connect our external adapter. We have Ethernet 0 adapter and we have our onboard Wi-Fi adapter, WLAN 0. Now let's plug our external adapter. And if I repeat the command, now you see we have WLAN 1. Next, we are going to terminate process that might interfere with the aircraft NG suite we use in this tutorial. Then we change adapter mode into monitoring. Let's confirm the monitoring mode by executing command iwconfig. Okay, our Wi-Fi adapter is in monitoring mode and we can start scanning the around wireless networks. Let's type sudo irodump and gwlan one man because this is the new name of the interface in monitoring mode. Here, we need to pick the network we are going to attack. I'm running a dedicated Wi-Fi network for this tutorial, so we are going to pick that one. My SSID is lab SSID for tutorials. This is the SSID and MAC address of our wireless network. Now, let's run the command to capture the traffic and save it in file. Okay, so we are saving it in the file captured. We are saying that we need to scan the capture the traffic on the channel one and with this MAC address of the access point from this interface. Okay, let's run it. Now, we are capturing traffic and now we need to catch the moment of a client joining to a Wi-Fi network so that we can capture the handshake. We have two options. We can wait for someone to join the network or we can forcibly disconnect clients from the network and capture the handshake when they join back. Let's not wait and disconnect everyone from the network. This is my lab SSID for tutorials and my iPhone is connected to that network. Now it's time for the, the authentication attack. That's basically where we broadcast disconnect messages, double force clients on this SSID to be disconnected. Once we stop the, the authentication attack, the clients will try to join again and that's where we'll catch the handshake. So let's run the attack. Okay, we are ready to hit enter and watch on my phone, it will disconnect the Wi-Fi network. You see what happened? So we've disconnected from the network and now the iPhone is trying to connect again and as you can see, we captured the WPA handshake. Okay, now this handshake is in our file. This is what we wanted to catch. Now we can run through the words list and find the key if that key is there. Okay, we are going through the list. And here's our key. We found it. 
it took like nearly two minutes to find this key but uh, yeah this is how you hack the wi-fi network thank you for watching the entire video please give a thumbs up if you like the content and subscribe if you'd like to see more you can hire us for a project by going to itsolutionsnetwork.io and clicking the hire us button at the top thank you again and we look forward to hearing from you in the meantime check out some of our other videos